The Centaur control panel gives you the flexibility of setting up multiple returns from your computer. Let me show you how. We're using our main DAW, which is Pro Tools, and we have that assigned automatically to channels one and eight, which comes back on Thunderbolt playback, which is this right here. So let's go ahead and label that. But we also want to have a separate output for our computer playback for apps like YouTube or iTunes. So let me show you how to do that. On the search tab, you're going to open up Audio MIDI Setup. And this is standard for any OSX operating system. Choose the Zen Tour. You want to make sure you're set to output. This way you can configure the speakers to be left and right, and that can be assigned to any number. In fact, it can be assigned to any available channel on the Thunderbolt playback or USB playback if you're using USB connection. So we already know that Pro Tools is coming out of one and two. So we're gonna assign our computer playback to be three and four. Click apply, done, and close it out. So we're gonna use channels three and four for that. And that's gonna be labeled OSX1 and OSX2. So we can see that that's assigned to AFX channels. Now we might want that or we might not. For now, let's do the following. Let's take the Thunderbolt playback and assign them to one of our mixers. So we'll choose mix one, mixer one, which is mix channel one, and assign it to these first four channels. So when we go to our mixer, that's gonna be PT one and two, that's a playback from Pro Tools, and then OSX one and two. Let's test that out. We're playing back the audio from Pro Tools. That's coming up here. We can link them. We show the pan left and right. Okay, and let's test out the uh, OSX output. So for this, I'm gonna use iTunes. Group these channels, pan left and right, and turn them down. So using this method of routing, you can assign multiple playbacks from your computer to be routed to the mixer. And then from here, you can monitor that on your main speakers, or you can take it a step further, which is what we're gonna do in our next video.